Hey everyone, welcome to Simply Learn's YouTube channel. Today, we will be discussing the fundamental differences between the leading business analytics tools that is the Excel and Tableau. Before we begin, let me tell you guys that we have daily updates on multiple technologies. If you are a tech geek in a continuous hunt for latest technological trends, then consider getting subscribed to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit that bell icon to never miss an update from Simply Learn. Now without further ado, let's begin with our session. So we have our one point agenda that is the Excel versus Tableau. Since we are discussing the fundamental differences between the data visualization tools, let us understand first what exactly data visualization is. So data visualization can be defined as an act of representing the information and data in a graphical format using visual elements like graphs, maps and charts. So basically what you will be doing is you will be collecting the data related to your business or any organization and represent the same data in the form of visually appealing graphs, charts, etc, etc. So that the information what you want to represent is in the more readable form for the user. Followed by data visualization, let us continue with what exactly Tableau is. So Tableau is a data analytics and visualization engine that simplifies the efforts of generating interactive data analytics and visualizations. Similarly, let us quickly understand what exactly is Excel. So similar to Tableau, Microsoft Excel is a software used to store numbers and data in the form of organized sheets. Excel can perform mathematical calculations and represent the data in the form of charts. Now that we have understood what exactly data visualization is and a brief introduction to Tableau and Excel, let us begin with the differences between the two fundamental business analytics tools. Excel versus Tableau. So the first difference is who prefers to use Tableau and who prefers to use Excel. So basically Excel is preferred by the professionals who are proficient in extract, transform and load operations other than ETL, DBA also prefers an Excel sheet and some real time developers also prefer to use Excel sheets. And now getting into Tableau, the professionals who are experts in data science and data analytics prefer to use Tableau. The next difference between the two is the real time support. So when you're performing some mathematical operations on either of these tools that is Excel and Tableau, there are some fundamental requirements that needs to be satisfied. In case of Excel, Excel needs external programs for running real time applications. Whereas in Tableau, Tableau provides all the real time interactions without the need of any external programs to perform the mathematical operations or to create visualizations. Now the next difference between the two is the skills required. Now when you come into Excel, you need some basic programming skills and scripting skills to use Excel. But in case of Tableau, you don't need any coding skills because it already has all the database queries run against all the data that you have loaded onto Tableau in the background without the necessity for you to code something new. Now followed by this, the next difference between the two is functionality. So the basic functionality of Excel is to store and manipulate data according to the user's requirements. But when it comes to Tableau, the fundamental functionality of Tableau is only to visualize data and represent the data in the form of visually appealing charts and graphs. The next difference is related to automation. Automation is something which doesn't require the human interaction with data. But now when we come into Excel, the data refreshment or whatever the changes you made to the data, if you want that changes to be implemented onto your data, you need to manually refresh it. But when it comes to Tableau, Tableau will automatically take care of all the data changes that you have implemented. So the next difference between the two is cost. The Microsoft Excel is not available as a single product. If you want to use Microsoft Excel, then you need to buy all the Microsoft products such as Microsoft Access, Microsoft PowerPoint, etc, etc, as all of these come as a single package. Now when it comes to Tableau, Tableau is available in different versions. The open source version that is the Tableau public, the desktop version that is the Tableau desktop. So relatively you have five to six varieties in Tableau and everything has a different cost. And Tableau public is completely open source and free. So compared to Tableau, Excel happens to be a little expensive and Tableau is a little less expensive compared to Excel. Now the next difference between the both, business purpose. 
So the major business purpose for what Excel is used is to get quick on and off reports. Whereas for Tableau, the main purpose of Tableau is to learn the business patterns and extract data insights to take up business oriented decisions. Followed by this, we have our next difference, the data source integration. Now this is where the Tableau has the sharper edge against Excel. Since Excel has compatibility with limited sources such as another Excel sheet or some database, it cannot compete with Tableau head to head. Whereas Tableau has powerful compatibility with almost every available data source, maybe a JSON file, maybe an Excel sheet, maybe a data source such as DBMS, RDBMS, etc, etc, or cloud, anything, even a website. Now followed by this, the next difference between the both. So the next difference is the capacity. So Excel is suitable for small scale data such as an organization data. But whereas Tableau, it has a powerful capacity. It can support both small scale and large scale and some bigger data sources such as cloud. Followed by capacity, the next major difference between Excel and Tableau is the language support. The Microsoft Excel has limited compatibility with programming languages. It can support only C Sharp and C++. Whereas Tableau is compatible with a wide range of programming languages like C++, C Sharp, Python, R, etc, etc. Now these were the fundamental differences between the Excel and Tableau. Now let us move on to our next topic where we will discuss the average highest salary of Tableau experts. So according to Glassdoor, the average highest salary of a W expert is nearly 10 lakh rupees per annum in India. Now we shall also discuss the average highest salary of Excel experts in India. So according to Glassdoor, the average highest salary of Excel experts in India is nearly 8 lakhs per annum. Now we shall discuss the career options for W. So the career options for W experts are as follows. The Tableau Consultant, Tableau Architect, Tableau Developer, Data Analyst and Business Analyst. Now let us discuss the career options for Excel experts. So the career options for Excel experts are to become an Administrative Executive, Project Manager, Data Journalist, Financial Analyst and Business Analyst. So with this, we have come to an end of this session where we have discussed what exactly data visualization is, what Tableau is, what Excel is and the fundamental differences between the both. And followed by that, we have also discussed the average highest salary of Tableau experts and Excel experts and also the career opportunities for both these professionals. I hope the video was informative and interesting. If you have any queries regarding the topics discussed in this particular tutorial, then please feel free to drop them down in the comment section below. Our 24-7 experts will be happy to resolve all your queries. Until next time, thank you, stay safe and keep learning. Hi there, if you like this video, subscribe to the Simply Learn YouTube channel and click here to watch similar videos. To nerd up and get certified, click here.